Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to Let's Play of Civ 5 as Venice. So, I've seen some comments that people are going like, Oh, this game is, you're making it too easy on yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, um, I don't know. I mean, I tried a lot of different strategies in normal. So, the fact that I'm doing this well, I think is partially because, A, the map type doesn't allow for the AI to really expand as much as they normally do. Because there's no way at this point in the game that the AI would only have, like, five cities. On a Pangea map, the AI had, like, 10 to 20 and I'd only have about five so I think the map type actually normally constrains them and that's been the biggest factor ultimately uh, the getting the signs I'm getting from the city-states is 3 340 that's not really enough to warrant uh, too much and besides I think Venice is actually relatively OP just in general uh, if once you get enough trade route if you get enough routes like I have 16 trade routes that's so much gold per turn I've got three of my ships feeding food to Venice which is giving it 91 per turn I mean that's just ridiculous so you know I think that it there's I, I've maximized my efficiency as Venice and that everything I've everything I've kind of done has been to get to where I am now because like I have a pretty sweet tech lead but I don't think that'd be the case on a different map even as anyone else but you know whatever I'm setting up the I mean like it's kind of it's kind of an oxymoron because like I wanted to go for a science victory well, at the same time in order to get a science victory you pretty much have to completely dominate the the opponents because the AI can run away with science so easily if you're not careful. So the fact that I have such a huge tech lead is probably going to help me do that. Let me see, where was I? It's been a while since I've played. Okay, so I need two more here. And, oh right, I was going to finish up Rationalism. In order to rush... Telecommunications. So we can go ahead and adopt one of these policies. Chance of rigging state solution is doubled. I don't care. I have enough money. That's not an issue. Uh, national wonders are plus one from every mint bank and stock exchange. So that's going to be two per city or one, two, three. Four, five, five. So two, four, six, eight, or five. I think this is gonna be six. I think. Actually, these guys probably shoot for the banks. Yeah, bank, stock. Yeah, they shoot for the bank and the stock exchange. And since I'm Venice, capitalism makes sense. Not that we need more happiness, but I don't even think anyone else is going down freedom. Uh, where would that be under? There we go. No one else has even had one. Money makes the world go round. It's the whole thing in the game. I found that uh, production is key. Growth. It's like the way the way I, well, the way I'll go if I need to build a bunch of stuff is I'll focus on production buildings and then food buildings because the production gets you the food buildings faster and the food makes your city grow, which gives you more of everything, which your production helps. Ik geloof dat ik iets heb wat u enig belang zal inboezemen. Zo, let's see. I want one more great musician. So probably age up for then. Twelve turns? Okay. Actually, I might not. Yeah, I'm gonna age up in the atomic era. So good call. As soon as I hit the atomic arrow, though, I go ahead and use them. I'm actually going to check. Let's do quick combat on. I'm not sure if that'll speed up the AI's turns. Because it seems to be stuck on the city state. But. Oh well.
Ha! Someone else gave me Merchant of Venice. Well, you know what? I don't, I'm not going to buy another city. I don't think I really, you know, have a need to. So... Let's see, we've got 181, 187, 167, now we'll just go here, nope, that's not what I wanted, I wanted Mafio Polo, that's a name I do not recognize, by the CCA conduct a trade mission, boom, lots of money. I can use to buy city states, buy buildings. See, do I want any? Buy building that next. Yeah, I'll get the hotel. A nice little boost of like what? Well, that went up a ton. I was at like that went up. That almost doubled. Yeah, it's because all the culture I'm getting from wonders. I can buy public schools with faith in the city? Huh. But no, I'd rather save my faith for... Yeah, like great engineers and stuff. So I can more quickly build my wonders. Alright, we have the World Congress. Which... Oh, we don't have... World Edge of Freedom and Historical Landmarks. Yeah, there's almost no way this isn't going to pass. And nobody's really going to... Oh, pff, I got 41 votes. Who cares? I'll just pass them both. Now, have I yet to meet someone still? One from City State. Following the world religion. Am I following the world religion? Yes, not that it matters. So I still have him at one city state. I think I set my ships up there to take care of it. I'll figure it out with satellites eventually. But it should be like here. This is the only place I can really see it being. Huh. Now, do I rush to this? No, I don't see a need to rush it, because I can buy whatever buildings I want to build. I'd rather rush the Sydney Opera House with the free social policy. Yeah, we're going to do that. Fifteen turns. I may just, like, just straight up build them. It's like what we do. Where's my production at? 109? That's not actually even that good. A nice 150% boost. Or 150 culture boost per turn. Given that... Given that I only have one city that this is counting to, we don't have that much of a cost. So you see you're giving me half my culture, which is awesome. Buy a medical lab in Venice. Oh my gosh, a medical lab in Venice? Considering it's already growing it like in like six, seven turns. I just wonder how big we can get Venice. <laughs> oh boy. That's gonna be my goal. I wanna get a science victory and just see how big Venice can get.
We do want to continue with the happiness in order to get more golden ages as well. Oh, and I forgot to mention, once again, uh, for those of you who don't know, that there is a vote on my website. The link's down in the description. You have to go to the polls link all through my main page. And for which Civ I'm going to play next, uh, two of them at the moment are standing out quite heavily. And uh, so I will definitely take that into consideration. I may not take the winner just because it, I want to, you know, make a decent change in terms of gameplay. So it kind of depends. We shall see. And what I'll end up doing is taking the two highest voted for for my next two Let's Plays, and then I'll do another vote. So 65% carried over with like 90 extra food. How am I getting so much f Oh, right, the city state's so only 34 here. I was gonna say. New unit for how many? A great general? Maybe? It'd be funny if that's what people wanted me to get. You see a commercial advantage? I just got two! What the heck? I like how my ships are like upgrading later. There we go. And not most of the things worth doing in the world. I mean, wow, I'm gonna have a whole standing army over there. I'm cool with that. Uh, let's see. Nope. Nope. Yeah, look at that. I'm getting a ton of gold from city states. Got another spy. I'm not really worried about losing. Brussels, Milan. Send you over to Milan. I could have him as a diplomat, actually. Because I can. Three, five, nine, eleven, thirteen, f seventeen, nineteen votes. So yeah, people mentioned that I could right-click it in order to get them all in there, which is great. Because I can completely control Congress. I'm basically like dictator. <laughs> I'm the entire legislative branch of the world. You have to do whatever I say. Oh, and I forgot to purchase Mech Lab. So I purchased it, right? Yep. Okay, there we go. Hopefully it'll count. I love this full, full guys in here. Uh, let's see. Are we working? We're not working every tile, which isn't really that surprising. 36 food per turn from trade routes. 69 from terrain, 15 from buildings. Half of the terrain is from that. We get the increase <clears throat> from the modifiers and the empire and the religious bonuses. Oh, that is so sweet. 40% on top of the top of that. Nuts! Of course they passed. Okay, so someone said that my city states or my, my uh, puppeted city should follow suit if I do something like uh, World's Fair. 
and I might as well. I'm not prepared to such an important World's Fair. Boom! Be funny if someone used international games too, because that would kind of suck, because I can't do both. So let's hope that doesn't happen. Oh, wait, Rome's turn. Embargo Mongolia. Okay. I'm not going to vote for it, but I sure as heck ain't going to vote against it. We've got 37 turns until that vote. And this is the only issue I have with the World Congress, is that I believe that the turns are based upon um, the, like, the time period. I could be mistaken. But, like, I'm gaining tech so quickly, and we'd have so long in between votes. Like, if this was, like, 25 turns, I think that'd be a little bit better. So I'm gonna get, like, I might even get to the next age by then. So, you know, it's just one of those things. People are saying, like, I should buy a navy, I should do this. I don't need to buy a navy. Oh, I can buy two ships, though, I just noticed. And someone also mentioned that the trade routes, if it adds a trade route then it'll let you know. It does. I don't think it did at first. I think that's new. Because I remember looking through them when I first tried to figure it out and it didn't tell me. Additional trade routes. Yeah. And... Uh-huh. Bada-bing, bada-boom. Fine if I just voted like a bunch of tried to vote like put a bunch of votes for everybody, but I can't do that. Okay, step one. Buy cargo ships. Step two, profit. And great rider pretty soon, which I will don't think I have any use for him. I'm, I'm not gonna get him for a bonus. Well, that's not true, actually, because I do have Oxford here. I guess it kind of depends. I'll have to value the culture over that. Gee, the only thing I need. Yeah, something I need is ecology for telecommunications. Which means, you know what, if I actually rush telecommunications and I do my timing right, I probably choose the great engineer for the CN tower. Build this in the opera house normally because it's not going to be as much production. Wow, <laughs> three turns. Oh my gosh. You know, maybe my next Merchant of Venice, I should flip a city-state that I don't really care, a type I don't care about. So, like another military one? Uh, Milan. And... Brussels. And I will do that in order to continuously shuttle food to my capital. So I'll definitely get more. I'll get more than from a city state here, but. See, which one had Lake Victoria in it? I totally forgot. Oh, here. La Venta. 
Okay, so I'm not a huge fan of doing that because it's right on Mongolian territory. I'd rather take over a, a militaristic city-state. But yeah. Wouldn't be bad. Let's see, I've got a city. Cities here, cities here. City right in the center. Militaristic. No militaristic city-states in this area. Hanoi is here. But a terrible city. Yeah, I kind of like Valletta. So I think next great merchant I get, send him down there, and then start shuttling even more food to Venice. Because I can. I also want to make sure I don't flip any cities that have any uranium. Because I get double. So I'd rather have city states just give it to me. No, oh, I even realized that they wanted that. Okay. I was just doing it to keep on boosting the influence. Marine, huh? Yeah, what we're gonna do is we're gonna gift that to La Venta. People were saying I should also should have gotten uh, Arsenal of Democracy. Eh, I don't really need the extra 20 influence. It's not that big a deal. You're no longer giving pressure. Okay. Well, I don't know if you ever were. Just keep going there. It's fine. It's fine. No, I don't. I don't want war. I want to win through pure science. Jak ci się podoba moja oferta? No. It's like, I really wish that it was like, yeah, I would love to help you, however, we do not run a charity, so make me, like, I would like something, a little something in return, and making it, like, even, like, really bad, like, for example, just, like, one luxury resource. Then maybe I'd be more willing to do it. But the fact is, it's nothing. I mean, I, I, it gives a positive diplo thing, but that's just a lot of money going into not a lot of benefit. So let's see, we're gonna grow next turn. How long? One great artist. That's nice. So just for science, huh? Coal from everybody. Yep. 54 in total. New Probium. And three. Wow! 37 to 38 in three turns. <gasps> oh my gosh. This is going to be like oversized 50. I wonder if there's an achievement for getting a city to size 50. Jak ci się podoba moja oferta? Yeah, sure. How are we doing in terms of influence by player? Some exotic with some... I really wish it'd tell me how much it's rising by. That would be really nice. Let's see, Brazil, I am exotic. With them, and they are... Yeah, unknown with me. So people were kind of freaking out, like, oh, you don't want to trade open borders with Brazil because their thing is, like, tourism-based. It's like, yeah, I know that, but usually the AI isn't that high. 
and their total is 20. Which is like, Greece has 26, but I have 105, and I have lots of culture. So, not a big deal. I got another unit? Give it to Antwerp, I guess. So, I'm, just gonna, I'm not really, I'm down doing this for the influence, I'm doing it more or less to help them out. discovered oil yet let's see yeah, you're not in your borders yeah, it's not a big deal it's fine if I don't <clears throat> get it too quickly oh I could tell you to Improve this tile, though, I think. No, well, yeah, because it's a farm. So you guys have specialists, right? Yeah. So nice. Full up specialists. It's so nice. And the science here is, yeah, minus 25%. Or puppet. Which is still, it's 152 science. That's not bad. We'll definitely get more science from puppeting city states. So that's something to keep in mind, but. Really? I'm second in crop yield? Not by much! And considering that crop yield is your total, I want to say, excess food? It could be total food, but I, I find that kind of funny. Golden Age! Love it. Are you kidding me? It's not here? Where is this last city? Up here? Let's see, does anyone have any resources to trade? Pozdrawiam cię. Mów dalej. Zabieniam się w such. Actually, let me, let me double check first. Salwe. You are finally starting to get extra. No. Really? You don't like me that much, huh? Kun okay. Fine by me. That's good enough. I'm not going to bother with anything else. Oh, and I could pop my great musicians. I think I'll just wait, because it's going to be next turn anyway. Okay. Finishing up commerce and getting four times gold from the great merchant, that would be nuts. That's a good, like, six to eight thousand gold per. Oh, great rider, huh? I think this sh should happen pretty soon. Let's see. Next turn? This turn? Am I getting a great rider, like, right now? Is that what that means? Because the math is perfect. OK. 
Okay, I got them both. I gonna say. Uh, go ahead and make these trade posts, I guess. Oh yeah, and what's We Love the King Day? Uh, we're in We Love the King Day. <clears throat> must have, I must have just entered it. 112 extra food, yay. Okay, so I can either get them there. 4,000 culture. That's practically a full policy. And since I'm not going for a tourism victory, this is way better. And I'm actually going to do as well. Just because... Maybe a quick movement. Just these guys moving a little bit faster. Keep doing whatever you were doing. Yeah, it moves these guys immediately, and that's, uh, I think, the primary source of my problems. Yeah, since I don't care for tourism, Agnes Day. Not a rock song, but whatever. because it has the most multipliers. And we have enough for a policy, which will be the next tenant here. So I could either get uh, Arsenal Democracy. Since I'm, since I'm probably going to end up buying all my military units, I don't think this is a big issue. The influence is nice, but I'm trading with city-states for influence anyway. And this is basically 10 turns of influence, which is like, oh, who cares? I don't need an army, so I think we'll go with the happiness. The city, str the city strength is quite nice, but the happiness, I like just a wee bit more. Um, you know, it doesn't give me much, but whatever. It's not a big deal. My next policy is in six turns. Which I will probably 1121. You know what? I can get another one before I finish up rationalism even. And there's no point in getting the spaceship parts yet, so we'll probably go down something else. But anyway, it's time for me to cut the video off. Thank you all very much for watching, and God bless.